Hey everyone, welcome to Tech Gamers World. In this video, I'm going to provide you with a quick and easy hands-on demonstration on how to take a Cessna Citation business jet from cold and dark to ready to taxi in a matter of minutes. So click that like button, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned. Let's do this. Okay, so here we are in the cockpit of our Cessna Citation. We're going to go ahead and get this plane started up. So the first thing you need to do is pull the yoke out of the way and check that the parking brake is in the on position, which it is. And the next thing we want to do is check and verify a couple more things. We need to check and make sure that the engine generators are set to on. This one is. I need to get on the other one here. Engine generator left is set to on. Great. Battery. I set the battery master to on. As you can see, one of the heads up displays becomes available. The others will not yet. The next thing we want to do here is go to this is the avionics master. We're going to set it to dispatch. Now here you would program in your flight path and stuff like that into the computer. But for purposes of this video, we're not going to do that. So we're not actually flying anywhere. As you can see, we have some master cautions because the plane engines are not actually running yet. Okay, we're just waiting up a second here. The manual says to give it about 30 seconds for the system to come online. We want to clear the safety master caution. As you can see, they've now disappeared. All right, so the next thing we want to do is starter engines. So we're going to start right to left. So we're going to hit the start set starter engine two on. And then we need to go and verify that the engines are starting up. I see some movement on the display there. So that's good. So the next thing we want to do is flip this cover here and hit engine run stop and we're going to switch it to run. So again, we're going right from left. So we're starting engine two first. So we've set that to run. Now we're going to do the same procedure for the left engine. Set starter engine one position. And then we're going to go ahead and hit that. You can see we've got some flashing there. That's all normal. So we've got the cover open. We just got to get on that switch. There we go. Set engine run stop switch number one to run. There we go. And then next we want to go ahead and go back to avionics master and switch it to on, which brings up the rest of our displays. Now this plane is up and running and is ready to fly. By this point you should have already inputted in your flight path, where you're going, the airport you're at, stuff like that. And you want to go ahead and turn on the lights. Now just for show purposes I'm going to demonstrate how to turn on all the lights. You would only turn on the lights you needed depending on what you're doing you know, where you are, time of day, weather, stuff like that. All the lights are on now. These are inoperable. Only the first five, six actually do anything. Okay, so this plane is ready to fly. I hope everybody enjoyed this video. 
you have any questions or comments, as always, please just drop a comment in the video. I will do my best to get it answered. Please click that like button, subscribe to my channel, and make sure you enable notifications. I want to have more new and exciting Flight Simulator content coming soon. Thanks a lot, everybody, and I will see you around.